All right, we're in round one, <clears throat> and this is a keep. All right. Hmm. I mean, I guess we don't have to trade. Hmm. I kind of want to find a better target. I think we're just going to attack. I'm willing to trade a Grasping Scoundrel for a Hardy Veteran. Let's put a Prey Counter on it. Pioneer, all right. I think we just attack with Scoundrel. No blocks, that's weird. All right. Um, I kind of want to kill the Pioneer more than the Veteran, but it probably makes more sense to kill the Veteran. Just because there's Merfolk bonuses and stuff, but I think I still... I think I still fear the 2-4 more than them potentially having a Lord. Golden Demise Rip would be pretty nice. Hmm. Hmm, well, I'm not going to be able to win this race. It takes seven here, so I might just walk here and take three. I think we just need to buy some time until we get Tetsamok. And Pale does help. I guess we... 
Um, hmm. Yeah, I guess we impale. And then we'll leave the scoundrel back to trade with the... Or maybe block the four power creature. Oh, that's pretty cool. I don't know if I've ever seen that many before. It's an uncommon, too, and there's only two packs. Four of them is pretty nuts. Um, I think we're still just going to do this. So my dead, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then they buff it, so yeah, we're dead. So we'll go to game two. I don't think I have much of a sideboard. Uh, let's see here. Another mark. Not bad. They didn't show us any removal. I don't know what I would take out for the mark, though. So I think we'll just run it back. All right, we'll play first. Hmm, oh yeah. Oh yeah, we can keep that. That seems fine to me. Start her off with the sailor. All right, Kite Sail Corsair. Ooh, Spirewinders, actually. Pretty good draw. We're already up to seven on our Ascend, which is kind of nice. And then next turn, we can even pray something and play a Dust Charger if we want, if we so desire. Or better yet, we played Charger plus Scoundrel, and we got ourselves a we got ourselves a city's blessing. Unsurprisingly, reveals a forerunner of the heralds. I suppose when you have four of them. All right, let's just get our Ascend on. That's what I say. That's what I say. Beautiful. Donna's climbing. I mean, the nice thing is they still can't block our dust charger. Um, so how about I just golden demise and 
begin the process of winning, because this card is nuts. How's that sound? Pretty good. That's how it sounds to me. Because Golden Demise is just filth. Just a filthy, filthy card. Uh, one-sided board, board wipe for three mana? Yeah. That doesn't seem particularly fair, does it? No, it does not. Alright, I don't mind trading my Scoundrel for a hardy veteran if they want to take nine damage. Sure. You got it. Oh, I guess in response I could have, uh... That's kind of funny. I don't even think it matters, though. It's probably better to leave Tetsumaka surprise. This game, I mean. They already know we have it in our deck. All right, well, that played well for us there, didn't it? Yeah, this is at least a match where having two Golden Demise is really, really good for us. I mean, I, there's not a lot of matches where it's bad for you. Probably just like a fatty dinosaur deck would be the only one. Pretty much every other archetype, you're going to love having Golden Demise. It's good against pirates, vampires, obviously merfolk. Um, but yeah, this is a primo match for it. I still have another opportunity to bring in the mark. I just, I can't wrap my head around what I'm supposed to take out. So I think we're just going to once again run it back. All right. This is a keep. It's a nice hand. We got some removal. Oh, wait. Maybe I should have taken out the walk to plank, huh? Well, they do have non-merfolk, right? Just not a lot. <laughs> they, have a, they have a hardy veteran. I guess that would have been a pretty easy swap for Mark of the Vampire. Whoops. I always forget about Walk the Plank's downside. If they play Hardy Veteran, I'll just slam a Walk the Plank. Because I don't think we're going to be able to find a ton of targets for that. Um, I think we kill it. I don't want to deal with it. I guess that would have been another one that I could have walked the plank, though. Hmm. But then I wouldn't be able to play border this turn. That's true, too. They left open dive down mana, but I'm pretty sure I'm willing to trade a uh, dive down for nothing, potentially, here. So let's attack. It's yet another walk the plank target, too, which is relevant, but I'd much rather attack into it, yeah. So let's see if they use the dive down. If they do, that's, like I said, really good for us anyway. I definitely think the cutthroat's better than rig hauler. Yeah, so burn a card for literal nothing. No cost to us. We get a 3-3, we take a card out of their hand. I'd say we won that exchange. And they 
get a guild grove stalker. All right. So we're just gonna kill the archer and get in there. It's a good draw too. We gotta be getting pretty, five success. Yeah, we're pretty. Next turn we can have our ascend. So we'll just kill this now, and we'll attack. See if they double block. Really wouldn't mind if they didn't, yeah. Because now we can just go scoundrel and next turn we've got ourselves ascend. Uh oh. That's actually fine. We still have ascend. Guess I can't block that. Golden Demise again. <laughs> it's so unfair. Uh, yeah, we'll play the Charger and let's just get Ascend and then next turn we, we just set up for a nice Golden Demise. Especially since they probably play into Golden Demise at this point too. Well, they had a lot more non-merfolk creatures than I expected. Oh, that's so nice. So, how about we just get a three for one and attack for a million? So, we can't wait until next turn. We're just going to bust it now, but I'm really not even a little bit upset about that. We just just demolish the board. Yeah. And we get to attack for what? Three, six, eight. They can go to one, I think. Yeah. They play a pioneer to get three blockers and they still don't have enough to stop all of our guys. Well, there you have it. Nice. All right, we'll see you around two.